Hey there guys, um, lately I've been doing a lot of bass fishing, I'm kind of ran out of my lures and I need to make some more crawdads, so I'm just going to do a real quick shoot, kind of show you what I'm going to do. I got my block of uh, uh, plastic which I'm going to melt down and I got my moles, so it's going to take me a little time because I don't really have two moles, but this is what actually what I'm going to be casting, so um, keep tuned. And you'll get to see what I do. All right. So in order for me to do anything with this plastic, I gotta cut it down and put it in, remelt it. I put some fuel stabilizer on it so it doesn't turn the actual color and you know or burn it. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take part of this, melt it, and uh, color, add that color to the uh, claws of this. The body's going to be a different color. So I'll pour that first, and then once those are poured, I'll put the two pieces together, heat up a different color plastic, and then inject it. So in order for me to do that first, I need to cut this down and, and, and then melt it down and pour. Alright guys, I'm heating up the plastic, I added, added some glitter on it, I also had to add a little bit of more color, this is uh, the fluorescent uh, chartus, and uh, in a minute I'll be pouring for the, for the crawls. Okay, so I poured the one half of this in chartus. Now I'm going to do is I'm going to put this other half on here. Cinch it down with the uh, the locks, and then I'm going to inject a different color. So the other half, the other half of that is going to be either you know brown or whatever color I choose. I haven't decided on what I'm going to do. I'm going to try probably the pumpkin seed color and see how that looks. Alright folks, I'm about done shooting my last uh, crawl dad. This is the end result. Um, I did multiple colors. I tried to do a uh, uh, two-tone, but for some reason or another I'm a, I'm a little bit out of practice with that and my injectors weren't working right. Um, here's another, another crawl dad, different color. Got a little uh, blue glitter in it. Also made a stingray grub, nice and fat. 
add some a little bit hardener in it so uh, you know on the bite doesn't fall apart and then here's one of my crawl dads I try to do two colors if you can see there's you know the chartreuse and the uh, purple but I just wasn't getting it today I don't know normally I do you know I get good results but I don't know I'm not into this today but here's a worm that I did uh, two color this is one that I have used in the Everglades it's pretty torn up I don't throw any of my plastic out because I can recycle it again that's the beauty part about you know cooking this stuff you can recook it here's a, a worm that I used in the Everglades torn up I'm just gonna recycle it and make more worms out of it um, and that's about it folks there's nothing more I'll probably show you what I made in a, in a little bit I'll lay it all out and you guys can see all right guys um, this is the end of my uh, soft plastic making and I laid it laid everything out so you guys can see I made some uh, purple uh, grub stingray grubs I made some crawdads with the purple flakes in it pumpkin seed crawdad chartreuse oops chartreuse uh, stingray grub also made a uh, pumpkin seed and um, these are all scented I use the uh, garlic flavor scent with some salt yeah the glitter let me see if you can see this in the Sun so it's got little tiny flakes of glitter it should work well considering um, the scents I'm using are Procure, go in here, that's what you can see, they have UV flash in them, which is nice, anytime I throw those uh, lures out there, the bass will see it, or anything else that particularly that is hitting it. Um, I wish I had another mole of these because it takes me a little time to make these. Uh, this is a single injection and I was kind of dumb when I ordered it. I should have made a, ordered it a double or even triple injection but I didn't think about it. But we'll see. We're going to give it a try and see how these work out. I know um, I've been using them quite a bit in the Everglades so anyway thanks for watching folks.